Welcome back. Today we are going to talk about early neurological stimulation, otherwise known as ENS. ENS was a program developed by the United States military in order to create better working dogs. It is a series of exercises performed by the breeder on neonatal puppies from day 3 to day 16 of the puppy's life. And it is meant to basically wake up the puppy's nervous system a little bit earlier than it normally would, therefore giving it a little bit of a kickstart. The benefits to these exercises have been shown to impact the puppy for the rest of its life. Dogs that were exposed to ENS protocols as puppies have shown greater resistance to disease, a higher tolerance for stress, a stronger heartbeat, and more active and quick to explore. So what are these awesome protocols that can help us breed better dogs? Thankfully, they're pretty simple and pretty easy. They are five specific exercises that are performed for three to five seconds on each individual puppy once a day. First, we have tactile stimulation. We hold the puppy and use a Q-tip to tickle one of the puppy's feet, alternating between feet each day. The second protocol is simply holding the puppy erect with the head directly above the tail. The third protocol is the exact opposite, holding the puppy with the head facing towards the ground. The fourth protocol is holding the puppy flat on its back with the legs in the air. Puppies tend to love this position and some will immediately relax and try to go to sleep. However, we do get a few that struggle. The fifth protocol is thermal stimulation. Placing the puppy belly down on a towel that is either damp or has been chilled in the freezer. This stimulates the puppy's body all over and they generally try to move around as it's a very unusual sensation for them. And that's it, we're done. It's pretty easy and just a few minutes a day with each puppy can make a big difference. Keep in mind, early neurological stimulation is not at all meant to replace the regular picking up, touching, stroking, petting, and handling of these puppies. Like everything else I do, these protocols are meant to help create stable, well-rounded adult dogs that are easy to handle and a joy to have around. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to come back next week. We will be talking about early scent introduction or ESI.